Hey there, everyone! This is El Galvin Megalex 3 Top 5! We are... There's, what, like, a week of Magalex 3 left? It's kind of hard to believe, but also it's kind of wild being able to quantify it with so much precision. This is so cool. These, like, warp pads are so rad. But well, last time we went into the sun, never been there before, and I'll be there again sometime. There's a map of Dora and Beat before. There's the Lord of Magalex level over there. Watch out for crows, they give you information that you might not want. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, well, here we go. Fifth place by Mr. Caves, Posse Swamp. We've reached score over a hundred with the regular spread that I expect. All right, well, let's go. 3.5 everywhere. Mr. Caves has a level. Oh, geez, the music. All right, those beetles quill so sharp. Even spin jumping is bad. All right, green spinies, serious. Yeah, see how long their spiny spines are. Spin the spine. Uh, all havoc, following a line. Don't worry about it. Ooh. Oh, why did I think that ducking would help? A valid question to ask. <laughs> All right, so let's time ourselves carefully here. Ooh, see, you got it. Whoa, yeah, that's right. <laughs> would I be able to recreate that? I don't know. Here's the cave. Well, there's okay, so you want to watch out. Oh, and there I should have hurried up, but it turns out the timing is fine. All right, so we got ourselves a bubble goop crap situation going on here. Got it. Just go, go. Go, go, Goomba. Or Spiny. No, we're not gonna look. All right, so hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. That guy's there. He sure is. And that's gonna eject someone, so be careful. This is really cool. I'm gonna do it. Oh, that was safe. Oh, it's Castlevania music, the good one. All right, no wonder I'm feeling it. All right, look at that. Creating your own musical staff. Well, I only didn't put anything in a middle bar. No, that's not true. Just making it, you can have multiple per, of course, on this guitar string, Lord. Drum, 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 drum. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I messed that one up. I messed that one up, but I'm invincible now. Alright. Alright. Yeah. Try to avoid touching things if you can. That's just a good sentiment to share overall. This is real neat. I am digging this. Oh, jeez. Egg zone here with that guy. He doesn't have a name. And his descriptive is really bad. Woo! Just that guy. All right, hey! Okay, okay, we're scrolling through the universe, but more importantly, I get to eat this flag. Enter these doors at the right time to avoid the beetles. So you got this door and got that door. Is there a difference why we want to take a door over the... Oh, that leads here. Okay, so the doors lead... I don't understand. So you do this. Okay, and I was supposed to find that out there. That they're just there to give you some invincibility. All right, I completely misunderstood. Just using the fact that you're impermeable while you're standing in front of a door callously. All right, and they just kind of do that. So it's like door zone, door place, door face, door magic. I cast door. Alright, um, I'm gonna assume that these warp you a little bit ahead. There you go. See, this makes a lot more sense, right? I don't know what this means. It means I'm gonna... Okay, alright, that's what that means. You gotta hurry up and open up those doors. Press that up button with great force. But maybe you want... Nah, see, you don't want to do that. I, 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 I tricked myself there about nothing. Oh, that's ridiculous. So, whoa, yeah, so you appear where the, yeah, oh geez, that's hard to time. Very interesting though, just running with those doors. See, this is where you're supposed to like try it out and see what happens. Like. No, 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 no. 
I don't think you can just hold it. Like, I think you do need a tap. Right? Can you time things a little bit in advance? Sometimes. Or like, in such a- oh jeez. Alright, just, just, just get up there. Yeah, don't worry about- here, this one's a bit easier. Just get up there, and you're safe. What? Uh, uh, that's really unfortunate. What am I looking at here? Something that's not as complicated as it looks like. Okay, I see what's going on here. Yeah, this is so cool. It doesn't make any sense, but I love it. All right. Now we're got this very slow... Oh, scroll. Oh man, putting rails on a layer. Is that... I feel like that's something you can't normally do. But like something's being done to make it happen. I don't know. It's just like not something I recall ever encountering. Alright. Uh, the Elder Scroll is so smooth. Alright. Um, it's just kinda hot. These call okay, you want me to go in that? Yeah, I didn't made that. So I'm just gonna go real quick here. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna walk through every obstacle you present here. Hey, this is a rational thing to do. Hi there, buddy. Like, how do you do this part? Oh. It hit away. Okay. That's how. Ooh. I- I span jump just out of reflex, really? Yeah, 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 so they just leave! Oh, this is scary. I love it, though. Alright, so- uh, 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 Yeah! Make those sounds! Okay, things- Oh, oh, this is a big spine. And he's making beep 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 sound. He's a beeping spiny. Someone left their alarm on. On this spiny. And he's pretty big, so you gotta take it seriously. Yeah, there we go. Taking like possibly the worst path through this. It's fine. It's fine. Oh jeez. Alright, beep beep beep. Yeah, I see he backs up a little bit, like he rears back. So it gives you a chance to prepare for it. Or not do anything and just Decide you're gonna take the hit. It's not good. Uh, I look. I love reading giant question marks. I have a lot more to say. Than yeah, I do that. Yeah, I saw that syllable. Okay, so you know how this works. We've done this before. We're just reviewing the level here. It's cool. This is gonna teleport me. Beep, beep, beep. And then I'm gonna do that and end up underneath. Alright, didn't expect that somehow. Alright, well this is weirdly nice. I, honestly? Oh jeez, yeah, I uh... You know what? It's fine, beep, beep. I'm invincible while I change size! Uh, yeah, don't hit no switches. So we got the old switch maze here. Does it matter though, or can you just know? It does. It does matter. Alright. Uh, I don't know if I like where this level is going now, but it's going here. Alright. Wait, what did I do? Uh, I have now the ability to press that re that green guy up here. Why is that something I want to do, though? Uh, questions you can ask your grandma. Okay, now that lets me hit blue guy here. Alright. So, are you satisfied with that answer your grandma gave you? Huh, Rauer? He is quite the angry guy. Just roaring it up. Alright, that lets us access up here. Well, I can press this button, and I'm gonna like pop. And it's like, I'm gonna stay here underneath this roof zone. And I'm gonna run underneath this guy. That's right, describing what is happening. Starfield! Uh, I got hurt in a dumb way there. Avoidable hits! <laughs> I think I love this level. Honestly, of World 12, this is my early favorite. Probably one of my favorite levels in the whole package up to now. Up there with a uh, Air Restaurant. Wrathful, sure. Everything else. Bonus lame. Where you get a lame from? What? <laughs> I disagree. Absolutely. 
I also had a blast that I would qualify as absolute. Just the doors. It's like all about, let's, let's put a bunch of gameplay about Smebex doors and what we can do with that. At least that's a big chunk of it. And also playing with the rails, like, ah, this, this is a real weird level, and I love it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the note block, that were obstacles, no, like, it's all just weird stuff. It's super weird. This is like a good yump. A good yump, too. So, no wonder I love this level. Yeah, we get like a big ol' uh, final exam. I still don't know about the presentation of the room with the switches where I gotta go back and forth, but whatever. I went through it and it's fine. Stellar stuff here, yo! I died like twice, so that's how you can tell the level was brutal. <laughs> It will catch the every man in a rage is an awesome potential alternate universe title. Oh man. <laughs> uh honestly you make a good point here. I don't think having the spine is not spin jumpable is that big of a deal. Yeah, most of the time you got like walls of them, or like just spin jumping will just not really do much for you. Or like they move fast enough that trying to time a spin jump on their top is probably harder than just straight up jumping above them. So I agree with that. Uh, I don't know if it was broken. Oh, the pace was broken. Yeah, yeah, yeah that kind of goes back to what I was saying. I see, we agree. Like, I feel like we agree a lot here. Come on! Uh, ooh, everything for first super great, huh? Oh, I like what comes afterward. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Jacob's Jank Juice Tonic. But I don't see the reason why I didn't use alternate universe titles. I feel like every title would come from Ramo, and that's just that's just not fair. See, I disagree. I think the moving doors are a good idea, but I'll admit they're weird. Uh, I'll admit, though, that the moving one could have a bit of a safer introduction, maybe a more gradual one, but I, I'm, I'm fine. Hmm. I got a feeling that this might be the last year we have MathFab. I, I was just kind of thinking about it, but like, if there's a Magalex 4, I don't think I will return MathFab for like a third one. Because we keep getting like, these really nice unprompted boss events within the levels themselves. Like this spiny dude, he could have been in a, in a MathFab, maybe he would do well? But at the same time, it benefits so much from having the level before it to introduce its Eggman that... Yeah, I feel like... I don't know. Just kind of musing out loud about things I've been thinking about before these days. Uh, Jankular Interlude. Posse Comitatus. Huh. <laughs> Wait, is that true? Galud is a declination from Goliath? I guess that makes sense, huh? I never thought of that. I'm gonna press the save button and I'm gonna jump down to my doom and then just lay on a ledge. That just keeps happening. Oh, don't pick my feet there. I need those. <laughs> 